Excuse no, me. No, give them it up close to the shoulders. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. VIC, very important crumbler. Personalized hello, 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 y'all. Oh, yeah. Honey, we, prior to this video, we, we received a very special package. A very... The most exciting, I don't know, the Halloween one was pretty fun. Let's do our thumbnail while we have our glasses on. Okay, but I'm going to show them up close these glasses. I don't typically like any sunglasses because they don't do much for me. I love these. Yeah. Thanks, mm -hmm. Crumble. We'll tell you everything, but. Oh, yeah. Honey, this is a new improved cutter. We'll open the. The box always gets in the way. Uh -huh. Honey, we're thrilled. Uh, Crumble comes through once again. With our members only Crumble jackets. I've never loved a jacket personalized. before. Personalized. I truly mean it. I love a personalized gift. I love to give gifts. Uh, and I love to receive gifts even. But I love to personalize a gift. And when we opened these jackets, first off, these are really good material. Yeah. And saw that they put our names on them. That and very just, important Crumbler. If you don't think that I'm wearing this for clout on Christmas... Yeah, oh. You're wrong. But. With our crumble, very important crumbler sunglasses. And our cutter made out of. A weapon? Lead. I mean, yeah. it is a metal crumble cookie cutter. We're yeah. thrilled. So, we got a package this week and it had our sunglasses, and our jackets, our cutters, and a note. A personalized little note. There's the back. It says, friends. we're better together. And it says, Tyler McKenzie, thank you so much for supporting and loving Crumble this year. We've had an amazing year and couldn't do it without fans like you. Thank you for being loyal VIC, very important Crumble, this year. Happy holidays, love Crumble. P.S. When are we coming back to Utah? Because we're ready. We are so ready. We are, are these ready. not cute? I just love getting mail. And then when you get unexpected packages, the, bo the cardboard box they came in even have cookies on them. Yeah. Crumble, Maddie, Abby, we love you. Thank love you. you. Thank you. We love them. I can't literally wait to wear these as a humble brag. I can't wait to go to Christmas Eve at your mom's literally in these. Oh, but yeah. Because she's immediately going to be annoyed. Okay. What am I food? Food. Huh? Nothing. Okay. Oh, really? <laughs> um, all right. So, y'all, it's Christmas week. Happy holidays and Merry Christmas to you and yours. Even if you don't celebrate Christmas, honey, you can still eat these cookies. Yeah. Um, so, let's talk about them. Let me get my little app up here. I'm actually very excited. None of them look overly sickeningly sweet, and I'm thrilled about that. There are three that are uniced, and I can't let this go without saying. Auburn Street oh, picked up these you. cookies plus two other boxes of cookies. Went through the whole debacle of using the vouchers and all the stuff. So, Auburn. Thanks, Auburn. She great. even picked up two boxes that I needed for our nurse's Christmas party tomorrow. So... She's a saint. Thank you, Auburn. You saved us a trip. You and her just... wants to come do it. I told her to I come. Know. Why I know. Why did she She's like, away? I don't think Mackenzie wants me to do it. Where has she formed that? I don't know. I'm spanking her. You are spanking her. So, honey, there's your invitation. Anytime you want to come, you Absolutely. come right away. You come next week. I want anybody to come do it with us. Nene is up there playing something. So, if that's what you're hearing. He decided to get a milk chocolate chip. I did, just because I wanted to try, and I was trying to make it easier on Sissy. Well, that's fine. Okay, so, let's talk about them. Birthday cake. This one is in my top five favorite crumble all-time favorite cookies. It's a deliciously smooth cake batter cookie topped with vanilla cream cheese frosting and a dash of red and green sprinkles. This one is delicious. This is a classic that they use at holidays because they use different sprinkles and stuff. Yeah. That or the X's the, and O's. And the Halloween. But that, No. X's and O's with the animals. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're a little different, but that one is one of my favorites. It's served warm. Next is Snickerdoodle. I'm already bored. Nene, well, I'm Rainy, actually calm, stop. Like. Soft yet crispy, a sweet vanilla sugar cookie coated in a sparkly cinnamon sugar crust. Love Snickerdoodle, but bored with it. Bored with it, but I'm excited about it. Red velvet white chip. Bored to death with it. Not as bored with this one. Your favorite cake elevated, a dark red velvet cookie loaded with gooey white chips. I mean, kind of bored with it, but not no. bored. Crumble. Less bored than Snickerdoodle. It's probably going to be delicious. What I'm saying, you know that we like the creative ones. We still love you. Yes. And I mean, come on. 
Please. Okay. Honey, we would eat a... Turd cookie. Yeah, I was getting ready to say that, but I didn't want to say... Yeah. Frozen hot chocolate. Yeah, I'm excited about this one. This is fun. This is what I'm looking for. Oh, same. It's so cute. Oh, and the marshmallows are so soft. A rich chocolate cookie smothered in hot cocoa flavored mousse and topped with fluffy mini marshmallows. She love loves mousse. a mousse. He hates it. I so. hate a mousse. It's fine. Even though it's, that's a chocolate one, I'm excited. It's fine. And Look at egg, the cookies on my shoulder. I know. That's not so cute. Eggnog. Serve chilled. I like eggnog. I'm, I'm just afraid. The last time I got super excited, it was pumpkin. Oh, yeah. It <clears throat> smells very much like eggnog. Did you get some of that nutmeg? Yeah. A festive sugar cookie topped with smooth eggnog buttercream frosting and a sprinkle of ground nutmeg. Buttercream can go one of two ways, so we will see. But Cre I, creativity wise. Oh, love it. I'm actually excited for, there's not one that I'm like, I'm not going to like. Milk, cho chocolate milk chocolate chip. chip. But I did heat it up, so we're going to try it. You know how to try it, I am. I want to try it compared try to the semi-sweets. Yeah. I forgot our paddles, y'all. I've had a very stressful day. We both have, and honey. I am not doing well. I had a personal PTSD <clears throat> moment happen yesterday. He had a fluke a car thing and weirdness today. It's just we But honey, we're holding out for crumble. We are. Nothing's gonna stop us from crumble, especially any of these jackets. Okay. So let's do the non ice ones first. Correct. Let's go ahead and do red velvet chip. Fine. I love red velvet. Can't wait to use this new crumble cutter, honey. And I'll tell you, it's heavy tea. Oh. <laughs> no. Do you want an eighth or a fourth? An eighth. Wow. Is that like, can you tell a huge difference? Oh my difference? lord, yes. I'm sure this one's going to be good. Oh yeah, I love red velvet. I do want us to do candy at moms. Oh, no, I do. Yeah, we are. Hmm. I think hitting it up helped it. Absolutely. Mmm. Nice and crispy on the edges. <clears throat> mm. the flavor's good. Mm hmm I'm just bored with it. <clears throat> Five. I love red velvet. Now. Fun. I always give my input that nobody cares about. I would like a red velvet cake cookie. So like yes. the pumpkin cake cookie. Like a whoopie pie. Like a whoopie pie and then a cream cheese frosting. Christy, <clears throat> let me know what you think of these, honey. Tyler. Um... Let's do some. Don't you think a cake cookie? Oh, a cake cookie with, with a, a cream, cream cheese, cheese icing frosting. would be delicious. Yeah. That's how I want you to revamp. I liked it though, but I think it could be better. I keep like remembering that I don't need to like. <clears throat> put all your force yeah. on into that. This is snickerdoodle. Again, I get it because tis the season for a cookie like this. I, I like yeah. that it looks underbaked. Cheers. How about a glaze? Like a cinnamon glaze? That's on the oatmeal ones that we've had. You know what I mean? A really good cookie. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm not getting a punch of cinnamon flavor. I think it's very light on the cinnamon. So if you are not, if you are adverse to cinnamon, I still think this is fine. Again, I really like the consistency of it. It's crispy on the edges and gooey in the middle. Yes. <clears throat> Six. Six. Fine. Okay, yeah. Fine. Not bad. Mm -hmm. And neither was the red velvet. I just, I need, I need them to be elevated. Uh -huh. I need those to be elevated slightly. And they could with slight changes. Absolutely. Up. Let's go ahead and taste the milk chocolate. Now y'all know if you watched our videos that when they introduced the semi-sweet, it changed our life. We were not expecting to be in love we with that, that cookie, <clears throat> and we have fallen in love with that cookie. We went back and got, I went back and got one last week. Yeah, did I? Yeah, because oh, I yeah, got it for the party it. and we split it, yeah. <clears throat> that one looks different. Well, I probably put it in there too oh, well. Oh, okay. It's just a little, <clears throat> a little more toasty than normal, honey. We heated these up because Auburn got these early. 
Mm, it's gooey. Mm -hmm. It's just going to be hard going from the promised land that yeah. was the semi-sweet back to the milk chocolate. Because if I remember correctly, I'm not crazy about Crumble's milk chocolate. Like the actual chocolate chips. It's, it's you good. can't go back. You mm -hmm. can't go back though. It's, it's, uh, the semi-sweet has that, the tiny bite of the semi-sweet chocolate is different. The salt is different. Also, the semi-sweet is chunks and I like that. A bigger piece of chocolate in the cookie. Not bad. And I would rate it higher if they hadn't come out with a semi-sweet and I liked oh, yeah. it so much. That's true. Four. Five. Not bad, just... The semi-sweet changed me. It changed me, too. I have high hopes that, to me, those were going to be the worst three. Not the worst three, the my lowest rated three. I'm really excited about the eggnog and scared. <clears throat> scared of the eggnog? Yeah. Mm. But we'll do the hot chocolate. Okay. Um, yeah, scared. I love... Creativity alone, love this. You get a oh, A plus for absolutely. that. I like the taste of hot chocolate. I'm just not crazy about mousse. If it's just gonna taste like chocolate pudding mm -hmm. on top, that's not hot chocolate. But we'll see. Give me a mousse. I will take a mousse. Do you want a fourth? Sure. Okay. Oh, love the cutter. I know. Gosh, we got to see those when we went to Utah, and I was wondering when we were gonna get one. Looks fine. Is there chunks? Uh-huh. Chocolate chunks in oh. there. Looks like it. I want to get a marshmallow. I'm a fan. Hmm? That's the kind of chocolate base I like. It's not too moussey. No. It's a little thicker. Mmm. I like it. Maybe I do get like a hot chocolate vibe from the mousse. I have another suggestion though. Mm. Instead of the chocolate mousse, a marshmallow cream. Mm. The chocolate cookie. The marshmallow cream situation. And then sprinkled with like cocoa the best, powder. Or the best of hot chocolate powder. That's what I mean. Yeah. Mm. Fine. Yeah. We that are, chocolate base is good. That chocolate base is good. I'm not mad. I've come to the realization I don't like their brownie base. That's the chocolate base yeah. that I do not like. Chocolate base is good. Creativity mm. is a 10 out of 10. Yep. <clears throat> so I'm going to say... Mm. <clears throat> Does it annoy you that I give suggestions about how to differentiate or to... Annoy me? Yeah. No. Because I like what they do. And I, I think their ideas are great. I mean, Absolutely. Eight. Eight and a half. Love it. I think. Do you think that could happen with a marshmallow cream in the yeah, dust? Yeah. Oh, you, honey, you know I love a marshmallow. Yeah. <clears throat> I would like a marshmallow cream on almost any cookie. Let's do egg on glass because I'm scared. <laughs> Completely made it. You're hitting me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm on a fourth of that one. She was on the phone with me this morning when I completely tore apart my grocery. I thought you wrecked. I'm laughing. I did wreck, basically. <laughs> you did. He said, I gotta call you back. I didn't even ask a question. She was like, say. <laughs> mm. I love this one. So this is different than the Halloween one? Yes. So the Halloween one has a white, melted white chocolate. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a cream cheese. Cream cheese frosting. But it's the same cookie. Mm. Nope. I don't think so. Mm -mm. Mm. Oh. This was in Valentine's week. Along with X's and O's. Oh, mm -hmm. that one's so good. Mm -hmm. And the icing is so good and not over the top, but the yeah. cookie's really good too. Mm -hmm. It's not the crumbly base. The mm -hmm. X's and O's has crumbly. Mm. This is the soft base with the cream cheese. Oh. Mm -hmm. Nothing, if people, if you, if you're like going to avoid this one because you don't like the taste of like birthday cake flavoring, 
This does not no, taste like birthday cake. It really doesn't. It tastes like the most delicious sugar cookie you can imagine with an amazing cream cheese icing. Mmm. Okay. Ooh. Mm. And it gets that egg flavor of the. Do y'all know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like when it tastes like eggs. Eggy. That doesn't make any sense, but you know what I mean. It's a 10. Same. We haven't given out a 10 in, in a, a long, long time. This is like nostalgic for me because it was from our beloved Valentine's box. But. No wonder you got three of those. Yeah. Not for myself, for the Christmas party tomorrow. Yeah. Sure. But. It. Honestly, doesn't give me birthday cake vibes at all. No. Delicious sugar cookie. Cookie vibes. with a nice sweetened cream cheese. Mm. And the and the cream cheese is not overly done. It's perfect. And then those little tiny, tiny, tea, tiny sprinkles. Yeah. Oh no. I love it. Eggnog, honey. I'm. I'm we should have left the birthday cake for the last. No, I'm hoping for the best. I'm hoping for the best. For, you want a fourth? I want one? an eight. I mean that. That's what I mean. An eight. Yeah. Because <laughs> I think this one's gonna be good. I think it's divisive because some people absolutely despise eggnog, and I think that the therefore the icing is going to be very sweet. However, love the fact that you thought to do it. Love the thought behind it. It smells a lot like eggnog, which I love. I just smells very nutmeggy. I don't know how it's going to translate into a cookie, but we're going to see. Not a icing. ton of flavor. The icing is really sweet. Mm hmm Yeah. To me. It's I that, don't feel that way. Well, it's that buttercream. It's the crumbly base. And I love it. I'm not a huge fan of it. That's good. I like it. Um, it definitely has an eggnog flavor, but if you hate eggnog, it's not going to completely turn you off from the cookie. It's spicy, mm -hmm. like, mm. you know I love that base. Like if I was tasting this blindfolded, I don't know that I would just call it eggnog. I wouldn't, but I really like that. I don't think it's that sweet at all. I'm just, <clears throat> I'm just a big fan of the cream cheese. I am too. It's my favorite. Any of the cream cheeses will always trump, but I'm not mad. Eight and a half. Seven. Fine. I like it. I've never not liked one that has that base though. Great week, well, in my opinion. You think? <clears throat> Y'all. She getting hot. Woo! Okay. So for me, number one, birthday cake. Oh, no, that's not even a question. Yeah. Number two, eggnog, hot chocolate. I almost want to put snickerdoodle above red velvet. Hmm? I don't think I rated it higher, but I kind of want to change that. Snickerdoodle, red velvet, cho milk chocolate chip. Mine is birthday cake number one. Uh, snickerdoodle number two. You hated the rest. No. Birthday cake number one, snickerdoodle two, milk chocolate three, hot chocolate four, red velvet five, eggnog six. Like just from a, now not from a rating specific standpoint, just from a, what I would continue to eat out of this box. Oh, wow. <clears throat> I, that icing is just a lot to me. That's so the funny. The flavor was good and it was unique and I loved it for that reason. But I think if I was going to have another bite, it would be a, a little snickerdoodle. Well, that birthday cake. Oh. I can't wait for everybody to have those tomorrow. That birthday cake is real good. If you're going to go get one, that's the one. That's this why week. I said we should take those to them. No, not top the nurses. That's oh. for the nurses. Honey, if you want to call Tyler Brooks and tell him you gave that away to his dad, by all means. Well, him, my little, and his brother, and his sister in law. Carmen, I tried. I don't think she watches these videos. Okay. Thank you again, Crumble, for our 
gifts. We love them. We are going to be wearing them on Christmas to make everybody jealous. We love you. Tyler became a new dad and you're trying to give away some cookies. Yeah. I mean, this plate's looking a little crumbly. Shoo! Y'all, we are a little worn out and weary today. But, but it's we're Christmas here. week. It's Christmas. Christmas times are coming. Christmas times Christmas here. Christmas times are coming. Like we're in it. Right Christmas now. times are coming. Is that a song? Yeah. And I know I'm coming home. Well, y'all, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, get notified every time I get asked a video. Also, get asked a video. <laughs> if you have any interest in helping me do my video of my Q&A, because I can't wait, I would love to see you like eye roll most of my answers. Oh, you're doing a Q&A? Yeah. Who it's submitted the questions? The viewers. Oh, <gasps> I did not know. And boy, have they been asking. There's like hundreds of questions. Nuh uh. Yeah, so I'm going to like, I'm gonna have to like categorize them. Oh, I would absolutely love to be a co-host of that. Right? Yeah. We'll do like a mukbang situation. You want to know why? It's because he's going to give you answers and I know it's not the truth. That's what I'm saying. You're going to eye roll every single answer. Because it's not the truth. I said, we're like, tell us about your dating life. What's your dating life like? What about your dating life? Are y'all married? Are y'all sisters? Yes. Y'all hate each other. Are y'all sisters? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. To all those. <laughs> <laughs> yes to every single one of those. <laughs> Correct. We're dating, divorced, married, and sisters. I love these glasses. I, I do too. Don't leave me out. Tell me what you're doing about. All right, y'all. Love you. Merry Christmas. We'll see you next week, and it'll be post-Christmas, so it'll be interesting to see what's on the Chroma lineup next week for after Christmas. We actually went out, though. I know. Okay. Bye, Bye. 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 B